برادر نظام الحمد لله الحمد لله وحده والصلاة والسلام على ملا نبي آبادا وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين أما بعد فأعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قال إني عبد الله وآتاني الكتاب وجعلني نبيا بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي أمري وحل الأغدة من لساني يخفه قولي Respected coordinator Brother Zakir Respected elders and all my dear brothers and sisters I welcome all of you with the Islamic greetings Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu Meaning may the peace, mercy and blessings of Almighty God Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be on all of you The topic of my talk is Mary, the mother of Jesus in Islam. We Muslims, as a whole, we believe that Jesus Christ was one of the mightiest messengers of God. We believe that he was born miraculously without any male intervention. We believe in his miracles, which he performed by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this mighty messenger of God is mentioned in the glorious Quran for no less than 25 times by name Jesus Christ is mentioned 25 times by name and the person who wrote the book as the Christian would claim that Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam wrote the book he concorded the book his name mentioned only for five times Jesus 25 times 500 percent more times than the prophet of Islam and the birthplace of G Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is not mentioned in the Quran the birthplace of prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is not mentioned his father's name is not mentioned his mother's name is not mentioned his friends his friend's name is not mentioned but the birthplace of Jesus Christ is mentioned in two places in the Holy Quran in Surah Ali Imran Ayah 42 in Surah Maryam, Ayah number 23, in two places, the birth of Jesus Christ is mentioned. And about the Holy Prophet Moses, the Prophet of Jews, the Holy Prophet Moses, as they, as they claim, he is mentioned 142 times in our book, in the book of Islam, the glorious Quran. He is mentioned 142 times. 1700 percent more times than the Prophet of Islam, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is mentioned only five times. Four times as Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and one time as Ahmad. The alternative of, uh, the alternative name of Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And the Christians and the Jews would claim that we are Antichrist. As I told, the birth of Jesus Christ is mentioned in Surah Al Imran, Surah 3 and 42, where the angels comes and, comes and say to the good news of Jesus, they come and say, Wa is Kalatil Malai Katu Ya Mariamu, Inna Allah Hastafaki, Wataharaki, Wastafaki Allah Nisal Alamin. Behold, the angel said, O Mary, God has chosen thee and purified thee and chosen thee above the women of all nations. Mary, the mother of Jesus in Islam, she is the woman chosen above the women of all nations. 
And I say such an honor, such a great honor is not to be found in the Christian Bible. Not to be found in the Christian Bible. And there is a chapter in the Holy Quran, chapter 19, by the name Surah Maryam, meaning chapter Mary. Again, such an honor is not to be found in the Christian Bible. You have Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, Peter, Paul, Corinthians, Galatians, Romans, 1st Peter, 2nd Peter. But there is no chapter by the name Chapter Mary. In Quran, there is a chapter by Surah Maryam. And when the angels come and say, Behold, the angel said, God has chosen thee and purified thee and chosen thee above the women of all nations. In the Bible, we find the same thing. When, G when the angels come and say the good news of Jesus Christ, we find in Luke chapter 2. They say, you have chosen about the woman of all nations. The answer, the re Mary replies to the angels in the Bible, she says, how can this be? How can this be when I know not a man? When I know not a man? Meaning sexually, she doesn't know not a man. In the Quran, she says, how can this be? when no man has touched me meaning sexually no man has touched her they are both trying to say the same thing no man has touched me and I know not a man but the replies given to Mary by angels in the Quran in the Quran and in the Bible are like chalk and cheese the poles apart the heavens and the earth they are like poles apart the reply given to Mary in the Bible